everybody. This is Joe with Joe's Premium Firewood. Bring you another fun-filled, exciting video. Today's video, I'm out in uh, outdoors with Eric's Woods, and uh, I'm out here to volunteer my time to help your boy Darren Hello. cut some ash up. Gotta, We're cut, gotta cut these trees. Gotta cut these trees. We got we got orders to fill, and uh, so we're out here. The first on the agenda is this ash log right here that uh, Darren's gonna cut. It's kind of in the swamp. I said how I would do it was uh, cut it, cut the end, the end off and cut the stump off and cut it in half and then drag it out to flat, dry ground. But he'd rather, he didn't forgot his mud boots. He'd rather just buck it up here and try to get the trailer close. Yeah. So I'm gonna clear a bunch of that out. Um, and uh, what I'm gonna be doing, I got the tripod here, but he's gonna be moving so fast I gotta move with him, so as soon as the filming's done, I'm going to help him if you guys understand that, you know, because if I just set the tripod up, I gotta constantly walk back to the tripod because he'll have this cut so fast. So I guess without further ado, Darren, yeah. you ready? Yeah, let's get Is the saw on. ready? Get let's get it on. on. You playing games? Darren don't play games. Okay, Darren don't play games. You heard it, folks. <laughs> show you around here how much uh, ash is out here right here there's one right here got this on the ground that on the ground <laughs> Darren just cut this down it was hung up it was hung up in that hackaberry tree but when he cut it he was standing you know right here and that broke off that limb broke off at the top and I'm like look out but I, I, it looked like it was gonna come right down on his head so you got to watch that when you're cutting this dead stuff but I'll probably cut all this stuff up here there's a, there's a dead ash tree right here. Perfect bundle grade. Nice tall one. There's one right here. There's one right there. You got this one right here. There's one. Nice 70 footer. There's one right here. You got this one on the ground. Darren's working his way to that. This one right here, that's half a, that is a hard maple, and that's ash, and it's like twins. Looks 
like you're going a little short. Those look like like uh, 13, 13, 13, 13, 13. Maybe a little bit longer. Okay. There you go. Try this saw. Hey Derek, can I try the saw out? Yeah. Come on, a cameraman for a minute. Sure. Take a break. Yeah. Okay. Don't, don't touch the power. Okay. Right there. Yeah. Okay. Hold on, do it because you don't want to. You don't want to walk away from me. Yeah. Don't stick your finger in front of the camera. I want to hold the other side there, Derek. If you can see, he's just a working and not cameraman. Joe, is it sharp? I like it. It might be stuck up in the air, you never know. Depends on how it's on the, the roof though. There you go. 
Oh, now you can cut it from the top. for a second so what size a uh, boot or shoe do you wear um uh, that you 13 13 yeah that's what i that's what i wear too so like when you go oh, it, you know see. like this this way, way you know up. so that one's probably about four, you know 14 15 this one I, just by looking i could t tell you that's 16 right there you know you got three maybe se that might even be 17 uh -huh. you know okay. but that's that's another way to check it to see sure. that one right there, that's a sixteen. Usually, right, that's sixteen. This screw right here. Yeah, yeah, I know. When you, sauce, when you, when you see. Sixteen. Yep, that was that's. I'm glad you showed us that. Let's go step on a couple of these. Let's just see how they compare. Yeah. But like I say, it, as long as they're over twelve, you know that that's what I that's what I like. You know, see that one's fourteen. Yep. You know. See, see how it is. I, like I say, I'd say these are a little bit on the shorter side, yeah. you know, and, and, and but they're in the acceptable range. Okay. So, all right, guys. Now I'm going to go to work. So we're going to put the camera away, and uh, I will be cutting and loading and doing all that stuff. We're going to get him. We're going to fill. We got his uh, his truck and trailer here, and uh, on the the Buick's back here. You see the Buick? Don't tell mom I got the Buick in the woods. All right, guys. Don't tell, don't tell them that. Oh, one we're other load, thing. We're going to load lugs in the Buick, right? Yeah, yeah. An uh, uh, oversized uh, trunk load. Oversized trunk load. Look, hey, and you notice something, Darren? Mm -hmm. who, who got you those? Who bought you those? JPF. Turn around. No bend over, bend over. No crack. No crack. We eliminated the crack problem. Hey. Crack kills. Nobody wants to see that, but Pam! I don't want to. I don't want to show my crack off at all. It's hard being tall. It is. It is. But you know, and it's hard not, not having a back with a crack and no butt. Right. You know, so that'll keep it up. But like I say, he's got a lot to do here. But uh, Eric said to get the stuff on the ground first, clean it up, make it look nice. Man, and, to bring my swamp boots to do the rest of it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how deep. I don't know how deep we're gonna go back there and get it because it's it it is really mucky back there and some of them look kind of rotted. Yeah. So, all right, time to get back to work, folks. Thanks, everybody, who made it to the end. See you on the next one. Have a good day.